Come in. Take your seats. So, uh, welcome to examination. I'm Shekhar. And what's your name? The Apanastri will be student one year for this recording. And what's your name? My name is Yam Varsha. Well, Yam Varsha will be student B for this assessment. Shall we go to the examination? Yes, sir. Uh, well, uh, student A. Uh, so, do you like uh, watching TV? Yes, sir. Why do you uh, like watching TV? Yeah, because you can learn things from from us, yeah, and uh, it will also entertain us. Yeah. Good. And where do you come from, Yamba uh, Sir, I come from Mussoorie Do you like Mussoorie? Sir, yeah, I like it, but at some aspects it is not very developed. So, so you want to switch over to your city? Yes. Yeah. Okay, mm, shall we go to the examination? Yes, sir. Uh, so, as you know that, uh, when you present your topic, uh, student uh, B will uh, ask a question and then when <coughs> student A, you present your topic, she will ask a question and I will also ask some questions. Okay, uh, now you are going to tell me about your topic. Sir, I am going to share my views on the topic hobbies and interests. Yes. Man has to work, work for others to earn for his living. During the course of his employment, he can't uh, do anything of his own interest. So whenever he gets leisure time, he does something of his own interest. This word is known as hobby. Different people have different types of hobbies. Some like poems, some read books, some sport, and some do different kinds of experiments. These are the things that uh, most of us do, but there are other kinds of hobbies too, like planting trees, collecting stamps. These are also hobbies of few people. After all this, there is a big question of uh, why people need hobby. Uh, hobbies have great advantages to human beings. Uh, great works, great theories, and great inventions are the outcomes of a man's hobby. Uh, hobbies can be uh, create great artists, great painters, great singers, great musicians, and everything great. So hobbies engage us during our leisure time and also saves us from the bore of work. Well, thank you. Uh, now uh, your turn to ask a question. Why do you think that uh, hobbies lead to great inventions? Because uh, while doing a hobby, people are uh, people get interested to it, so only they do that. And uh, something, uh, a thing which uh, in, the, in which we are interested, uh, it is easy for us to put our full efforts and create something new. Okay, well, uh, what do you think about people uh, who don't have any hobby? So I think they are so lazy and they waste their uh, time and they don't have interest and. In, uh, uh, think to achieve something in their life. Uh, can you tell me something about uh, <coughs> your hobby and how it helped? So my, hobby, my hobby is reading books, sir. Uh, it helps, uh, helped me to improve my vocabulary and my uh, creative skills and uh, imagination. Well, thank you, Aparna. Uh, now, so, so that we, remember, sir, you will be presenting the topic. Sir, I have uh, chosen a very interesting topic. It is the word called fashion. This word fashion covers almost the craze of all the aged people of different uh, varieties of different culture. Whoever the person may be, they will have some type of fashion. And whatever the famous people does or a celebrity does something different, it becomes a fashion in the society. For example, uh, during our independence struggle, it was a fashion to speak Hindi and uh, wear Kadi. And uh, even though the British had faded away away from our country, but still uh, we have shaken hands with the Western culture. And the queer mixture of both the languages have become a fashion. And we people uh, mix uh, two languages and we speak it and call it as a fashion. Not only that, uh, we here comes the question: Who does the fashion get influenced by? The fashion gets influenced by the economic authorities of a society, that is the celebrities who have the, all the name and fame and who create attention and whatever the thing which is uh, done in a glamorous and a catchy way, people like it and seek for it. Not only that, as we say fashion is very good, there are also some disadvantages in that. One must know the disadvantages of the fashion and the 
logic behind the fashion so that uh, he does not uh, become a mere victim of the consumerist culture and waste his money. Yeah. Now, uh, would you like to ask a question to your partner? Yes. Russia, how do you think uh, celebrities influence fashion? Yeah, celebrities of course influence fashion at the now because uh, they are the, I could say they are the attention seekers of the society because whatever they do, it's being published to everyone and we see what they do and we follow them and uh, we like to be like them. Well, uh, <clears throat> what do you think about uh, people uh, mixing family and families and the talk in uh, one language? Sir, mixing of both the languages reduces the quality of both the languages and spoils both the languages, sir. Yeah. It does not uh, bring advantages to both the languages and the people who does it. Yes, uh, you are right, uh, you are right, sir. <clears throat> okay, with this, uh, we come to the topic presentation, please. Let's go over. And now we are going to the next phase, problem solving. So in this phase, I will give you a card which has a problem. You will go through it and you will arrive at the solution. Okay. Uh, so you will read it and give the card. So here is your card, task number one. You and your friends have been selected to present your school at an inter school art and cultural fest with your partner to discuss what presentation you should make, what can be done differently, and be eco friendly. Atarna, you have been asked to represent our school in an inter school cultural fest. What do you think about it? I think it is a great thing and uh, what can be our presentation? After now I think uh, we could make a presentation as in the form of dance drama so that it, it could attract many people. Yeah, it's a great idea. But what is our theme? The theme could be like the best theme would be what I could say is saving our mother here. Which is the most important need in the present scenario. Yeah, Rasha, I think that's a great idea. And after the, what can be done differently? We can make it eco-friendly. Eco-friendly? How could it be eco-friendly? We can use something made out of waste materials. Yeah, that's really good. We can make the props, uh, what we are using for dance drama, and uh, something uh, from the waste thing so that it can But after the, do you think it's a good idea? And even though if it is, how could we make it so easy? We can ask our friends and our classmates to help us. And yeah, we can also get the support from teachers. They will also help us. Yeah, that's really good. But for now, if we have it, then we can definitely succeed in this. Well, uh, <coughs> I hope I have discussed it at all. And then, Yumba uh, Shah, so why is it important to make a dance drama on the theme of saving? Because uh, nowadays we start polluting our mother earth and, uh, and our earth is uh, dying day by day sir. To stop this we have to create awareness among people and uh, we must make them know the importance of our earth. So I proceed to stop it. Yes sir. <coughs> well said and uh, well, uh, is there any other way uh, to present this thing? of puppet show sir. Mm -hmm. It is a rare thing and uh, students will get attracted to it. Yeah. While we are doing it, we will also learn something new on how to do this puppet show and we will get training on it. So it will also help us. Very good. Well said. Uh, well, thank you for participating in the assessment. Thank you. Thank you. Sir.